Hi, how's it going everyone? Hope you're all doing good. In today's video, I'll be going over Firebase file uploads in React. So let's get right into it and create our Firebase project first. I'll give it a name and call it file uploads. And I'll create my project. And while that is busy uh, loading, uh, let's go ahead and install Firebase in our uh, React project. And our project has been set up. Let's go ahead and click continue. And here we'll just set up file storage. Then we'll click get started. We'll start in test mode and click done. Now we'll just give that a moment. And then uh, let's just go back to our project overview and then we'll add a web application here. Then we'll just give it a name for file upload as well. Then let's go ahead and register our app. And then uh, in our React project, um, in the source folder, I'll just create a new file. I'll call it Firebase. And this is where we'll have our Firebase config. So I'll copy all of this and paste it in there and go to console and we should be good so coming to the documentation here we first need to set up our file uh, upload or our storage so in order to do that if we scroll here we'll first need to import uh, get storage basically from firebase forward slash storage so in this file here uh, we just need get storage and then we'll create a new variable we'll call it uh, storage bucket and we'll just call get storage and then we'll pass our application and this will also export so it'll be export and then uh, we should import storage bucket from our app here so we'll just import storage bucket from firebase and then we'll also need uh, let's see, we also need to import ref, which we'll use to create a reference for the file that we create. And we'll also need to import bytes or upload bytes resumable. Uh, okay, this is being imported from the wrong place. Let me just copy from here instead. So we'll need ref and upload bytes resumable. So this one here. Now all the code I'll be implementing here, you can find in this documentation here. If you scroll through this documentation, uh, you'll find exactly what I'll be uh, going over in this uh, tutorial. So the first thing, uh, I've already got my input set up and once the input has changed or on change event uh, calls this upload file. And first thing, let's get the file that we the user has selected. So we'll say uh, file, we'll change this to an event instead and this will be e dot target okay there we go and then we'll need to create a storage ref using the uh, file name so we'll say let file ref So we'll use ref, which we just imported from Firebase forward slash storage. And then for our reference, we'll uh, need to pass the storage bucket as the first parameter. And then the second parameter will be the file name. So that's our reference. And then we'll need to create an, an upload task. So we'll create a new variable. We'll call it upload task.
and this will be upload bytes resumable. So the first parameter that we're going to pass is the file reference and then we pass the file itself as the second parameter and then uh, we can get like the progress of our file upload. And to do that, we'll just call upload task dot on state change, and then this will return a uh, snapshot. And then uh, let's just create a variable, uh, call it progress. And this progress, we get the bytes transferred, and then we divide it by the total bytes uh, of the uh, file, meaning the total size of the file, multiplied by 100, which will give us a percentage of how, how much has been uploaded so far. And then we can basically just console log. So console log upload is progress uh, percentage done. And you might have noticed that there's an autocomplete extension I'm using that's uh, GitHub Copilot. You can check it out. I've also put out a recent uh, video on this. So if you're interested, uh, be sure to check that out as well. So let's see if our upload function is actually working. So I'll go back in my application and I'll view my console. Let me have it on the side here. So let's uh, select a file to upload. Okay, let's upload this skull image. Uh, this is a skull object or 3D object that I use in the Viral React uh, Augmented Reality series. So if you're interested in that, be sure to check out that video or that series as well. Uh, let's select this image, click open, and then we should be getting a console log here. Oh, uh, let's run our application, sorry. Then we'll just uh, keep track of our storage bucket to see if any files have been uploaded there. So let's give this another go. Uh, select the image, click open. So we have 0% uploaded so far, and then 100%. And then if we come back here, let's just reload. So we have our scar here. Let's see if it's uploaded successfully. And there we go. So we have our preview being uh, displayed there. And that's how you'd go about uploading images in uh, Firebase. So yeah, uh, if you have any comments or suggestions, be sure to leave them down below. Uh, Till next time. Cheers.